Okay, just salam alaikum. Welcome back. It's your technician Muhammad. Today we're gonna do battery drain test with the OnePlus 8T uh, PUBG here. We're gonna test PUBG first for half hour. We're gonna check also the temperatures. I'll be playing it on max graphics, uh, uh, extreme mode, HDR, and just yes, HDR. If you want to check my UHD gameplay, check it on my YouTube channel. But we're gonna test the HDR for now. We're gonna wait until the battery drops to 83%. Uh, the setup which I'm using right now, Wi-Fi and screen brightness is at maximum. Just the screen brightness is at maximum, and also the speakers are at around 80% which I use with all my flagship smartphones previously. So we're going to play classic mode, like you see myself, classic mode. Uh, we're going to start immediately and we're going to uh, wait until the battery drops to 83%. Uh, we're going to measure all the thermals, temperatures and obviously we're going to see how much the battery will drain in half hour. Snapdragon 865, OnePlus 8T, 12 GB RAM variant, uh, 256 GB uh, ROM variant. Check this out, these graphics and check the smoothness. Absolutely beast. Such a beast for a gaming I highly recommend ninjas. Highly, highly recommend this beast. Beautiful. Stay tuned. So I'll note the time. OP AT 4500 mAh. Snapdragon 865. Android 11. They're going just 83%. It's 911. You can see that there. 911. Yeah. 83%. Let's do it. So I just noted the time. We start at 9:11 p.m. I'm going to finish at 9:41 p.m. We're going to see how much the battery will drop. The graphics of this game, bro, on HDR, especially on UHD on OnePlus 8T, oh, wow. Crazy. By the way, Ninjas, this is not a gaming test here to check the graphics, uh, the quality, uh, the frame rate and everything. This is a battery drain, a battery drain testage. If you want a test, if you want to check uh, maximum graphics details, UHD, check on my YouTube channel, special gameplay. This is just a battery uh, test reference because I do it with all my phones, flagship phones almost. And a lot of people love these videos, which I do. Uh, PUBG for half hour, one hour to see how much the battery will drain and then we're going to do some approximate calculation of how much you can play PUBG constantly uh, without anything, just playing games on OnePlus 8T. Wow, it's so smooth. Okay, stay tuned and we're going to see each other in 15 minutes. Okay, in 15 minutes. Just checking here the temperatures after 15 minutes of PUBG running on OnePlus 8T. Very impressive. I'm completely impressed that... Uh, check out the temperatures on the battery. 33 Celsius only. That is crazy good. Let me just show you right now that this is amazing uh, achievement for the OnePlus 8T. I can't even believe that it's running with this. Uh, <laughs> that is so cold. This is impressive. This is very, very impressive. Finally, OnePlus 8T done a great great job remember the ninja this is on full hd everything is max with the gfx tool hdr extreme mode and yes i didn't change the uh, display mode it's still at 120 hertz in the background this is very impressive screen brightness at maximum very very impressive results here regarding the battery temperatures i'm impressed you have to be impressed here I can even say easily that uh, it has better temperatures than those gaming phones from Black Shark and ROG. Can you, that's absolutely crazy. This new OnePlus 8T has a really amazing optimization regarding RAM management, heating dissipation, everything is just next level. Next level the OnePlus uh, device here. I don't know why a lot of reviewers said that it is no, it's not worth buying OnePlus 8T. I just don't get them. Do they even test this, these phones any these days anyways? Okay, now we're going to check a little bit the smoothness after almost 20 minutes of, ga uh, of PUBG gaming here on OnePlus 8T. Still full uh, experience in just full speed, 60 FPS, also there's 90 FPS, obviously support here for the OnePlus 8T. If you want to play it with the GFX tool, you can play it with the OnePlus 8T, bro. That's amazing, amazing performance. But you just have to admit, you have to check my gameplay of the UHD. UHD has lags. That is crazy. The UHD is still really insane, insane test there. Obviously, OnePlus 8T is a new device. It needs more, more optimization, obviously, more updates since it is just released a few weeks ago. But you can see by yourself that this is buttery smooth, man. Check this out.
HDR Extreme Mode, 1080p, everything is maxed in GFX tool. Max graphics, max shadows, max lighting effects. Okay, let's go next. Can you just, here we go, a half hour exactly since uh, we run this game on OnePlus 8T, 941, and we get 73%. Interesting, 73%, so basically 10% of the battery for half hour. That's very interesting, just. 10% of battery for half hour with the OnePlus 8T. You can see myself here, 941, 941, 73. Still exactly the same, same setup in Jazz Wi-Fi. Uh, basically, screen brightness is at maximum and speakers are at 80%. This is a heavy test in Jazz. Why it's heavy? Because I'm using the screen brightness at maximum indoors. Nobody will do that. But again, uh, I just want to push the smartphone to like more really hard, uh, hard, hard usage. Uh, I repeat again, if you play this game at 50% of the bet, uh, 50% the brightness obviously you're gonna get at least probably one hour more of the gaming this is very, very interesting so far what do we have uh, with the PUBG regarding the battery drain testage? I'm very, very satisfied. 4,500 mAh battery, Snapdragon A65. This is a really great, great result in just Great, great result. Check this out. The performance itself. Let me bring this here. What a smoothness, bro. What a smoothness. <laughs> wow, what a great phone. What a great phone, man. Beautiful phone. So, what I'm gonna do, Ninjas, uh, probably now I'm gonna go and test Fortnite. We'll see maybe other game. Uh, or we're gonna uh, leave it as it is right now. I'm super, super busy. Maybe later on if I find free time. But we will see. Stay tuned. Okay, Ninjas, so I thought I'm gonna test Fortnite, but no, let's go test Ark Survival Evolved. This is also very insane game for the battery drainage test. I'm testing it on epic mode, highest graphics, maximum graphics, I repeat again. Wi-Fi is enabled, brightness is at maximum, and speakers are at around 80, uh, 85%, 80%. Okay, let me just use, I love to use this mode. I love to use this mode. This is crazy high uh, quality. And there you go, 68%. I was waiting for 68%. Was at 69. It's 954 in just 954. So we're gonna play it till 1024. Yeah, we're gonna play it in 1024 again. The same like with the PUBG. We're gonna play it for half hour arc. We're gonna test the temperatures. We'll see how the temperatures will be after after 15 minutes. The thermals. You can see by itself. And uh, after half hour, we're gonna check the battery drain, drain drainage uh, percentage for the arc survival evolved. Will it be the same around 10%? 10%? I don't know. Check it out. Uh, what I need to uh, give a note that this game is running at 30 FPS. Yes, ninjas, even if you have a thousand millions of hertz uh, screen from 2300 uh, from the future, bring it. Uh, these games, a lot of Android games are still kept at 30 FPS. Most of them are running at 60 FPS. You can find maybe around dozens of them running at 90 or uh, at 120 FPS. And there are some uncapped games which are running maximum frame rates, which your screen has like for now, it is the 160 Hz with the ASUS ROG3. Is it this? Yeah, ASUS ROG3, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, stay tuned. I'm not going to show you, obviously, if you want to check a gaming review of the OnePlus 80, check it on my YouTube channel. This the, this video is just like a reference for the battery drain drainage and for thermals heating test. I will show you also on the end, probably maybe even the CPU throttling test benchmark results for the OnePlus 8T. Stay tuned for that one. Can just we are back. We played uh, basically the R or uh, the Arc Survival Evolved is already running more than 15 minutes with the OnePlus 8T. Check it out, really insane uh, game. Let's check here the temperatures. I'm blown away. <laughs> I'm honestly blown away with the OnePlus 8T. What kind of technology regarding the cooling system this device has? That is nuts, man. That is nuts. Unbelievable. But check that the battery temperature is 35 Celsius. On maximum brightness, maximum graphics, epic mode. I, I can't believe it. I don't even know how to explain this. Plus, remember that I'm having running in the back these three widgets, Ninjas. It's not like I completely clean the RAM, everything is uh, 
clean in the back only this game is running i have few apps running here also in the background uh, regarding checking these informations wow okay ninjas we are almost there one minute more and it's gonna be exactly half hour since arc uh, survival evolved is running on one plus at temperatures are crazy insane i don't know when the last time i saw this this kind of coolness on a flagship device with the arc and pubg that's absolutely insane bro i don't know what kind of magic one plus at has but this is by far the best heating this dissipation that i ever saw in a smartphone bro in a smartphone hands down the best smartphone right now i did somehow i don't know why but on 90 fps with the fortnite it does overheat i can't ex explain that but here to go right now with these all of these games ninjas there's no even heating issue at all it's so cold bro it's so cold so here we go 10 40 10 24 oh my god he just farted 10 24 58 percent 58 percent look at this it is exactly percentage the same percentage as like with the uh pubg Check this out, ninjas. The same percentage, 68 to 58 half hour, 10% for the, uh, of course, for the PUBG, 10% also for our survival evolved. That is crazy good, man. That is amazing, amazing results here for the OnePlus 8T. Hands down, one of the best battery monsters, uh, gaming monsters, uh, heating dissipation, uh, uh, throttling monsters. Basically, less throttles, less heat, uh, heats up. That is crazy. That is honestly crazy. I just don't get it why uh, it overheats with the Fortnite. Uh, I know why. It's running 90 FPS and Fortnite is 10 GB, uh, 10 gigabyte. Of storage of download just for the download to download Fortnite on one plus 80 it will take you around 10 GB plus when you uh, update it run it etc etc store your uh, information is gonna probably be around 12 13 GB uh, taking out of your storage it's the largest game on Android device for now Fortnite it's so huge bro. it's so huge anyway uh, I hope you enjoyed in this video again we're gonna check the temperatures for the end um, I don't know how to explain this honestly I don't know how in how this is possible that it's only 36 degrees I never saw in my, this in my life never ever ever on a flagship device this is so cool bro this is so cool <laughs> amazing anyway let's go quickly hey I'm gonna ask me about the back I tell you when the new phones in the last two or three years they don't heat up on the back bro as they mainly heat up on the front like you see the stuff it's super cold on the back check it out how cool it is on the back wow what a temperature <laughs> playing games for more than one hour bro and it's 36 maximum that is crazy and we're gonna go here to uh battery let's check here what the battery will tell us just a minute we have a better phone use more than usual PUBG ARC, okay, we get that. View the digital usage. PUBG took 10 to 11 percent. Oh, well, active used for 35 minutes. Okay, finally, finally, here we have a, a really proper. Uh, sorry for that. We have a really proper uh, calculation uh, with the oxygen OS. I mean, even before that, but with the MUI, MUI is terrible regarding that. Right now, oxygen is giving us exactly, check it out, Ninjas. It was running 33, 9 to 10 percent. It took 9 to 10 percent. Uh, where is this shown? Ah, it's just shown when I enter inside, it doesn't show how much the battery, it just shows here interesting check it out let's check the cpu throttling test for 15 uh, minutes 15 minutes is done and it took five percent 15 minutes so it's the same almost like gaming the cpu throttling app it's really amazing for testing and battery drainage just doing the cpu throttling test you can do it in just and test it it took exactly the same as arc or pubg 15 minute one single 15 minute test it took five percent of the battery unbelievable i mean just Highly recommend this device. You're not gonna regret it. Buy it. It's better buy than the Xiaomi Mi 10T, in my opinion. Better buy than the Redmi K30 Pro, uh, than other devices. Uh, example, uh, Samsung S20 or so. It's amazing, amazing device. The buying links will be in the description. You can buy it on Banggood, Trading Shenzhen, and CCT Shop. Plus, give us probably links I will leave. My salam. Okay, just so we're gonna test Fortnite uh, with a OnePlus 8T battery drainage test for half hour. I'm waiting until the battery drops to 85%. It's gonna be very interesting. Uh, so this is only the game uh, which has issue heating issue with the OnePlus 8T. I think it's regarding the optimization of the Fortnite or maybe because uh, obviously of the 90 FPS mode. So we're gonna go here. I will be selecting Epic Mode 90 FPS. I hope it's gonna run on Epic Mode Quality Presence and it's 90 FPS. 
this is the only Android smartphone in the world that can run Android uh, Fortnite at 90 FPS. That is crazy, Ninjas. So like you see, we have Self OnePlus 8T updated to the latest version, new update of Fortnite, 4500 mAh battery, Snapdragon A65, 120 Hz display fluid from Samsung AMOLED Beast. It's a complete beast, Ninjas. Let's play it. Let's do it. Bismillah. By the way, Ninjas, I'm already running Fortnite for maybe 20 minutes or so. This is the temperatures right now, obviously, in the menu. Uh, that's why you can see already that the phone is warm. I repeat again, uh, this is the probably because the Fortnite is running at 90 FPS and because this game is super huge. Uh, all the games, PUBG running on 1080p Ultra HD was not overheating. Can you believe that? Uh, Ark Survival Evolved, Call of Duty, all other games, no overheating, not even heating issues at all with the OnePlus. 80 86% uh, still 86% we're gonna wait until it drops to 85 I'm gonna put also the speakers at 80% just yeah screen brightness is at maximum I can see myself Wi-Fi is enabled same same test which I done with the PUBG and Arc survival evolved oh my god it's buttery smooth playing Fortnite on 30 FPS it's pain in the ass So check it out, here it's showing me 90 FPS epic quality presence. Check this out Ninjas, please check this out. That is crazy, that is crazy. <laughs> 80, still 86%, okay, let's drop. Eighty-six percent. Wow, <laughs> wow, so smooth. <laughs> Wow, what a beast, Ninjas. Uh, unbelievable. You would never expect Ninjas. I know that a lot of reviewers bash the OnePlus 8T. I don't know why they even do this. Do they even proper test the phones? Do they even have like a rational thinking, rational opinions, rational conclusions? Taking consideration everything what the phone offers for the price tag? 85%. It's 1123. So I'm going to play it till 11. 53 ninjas yeah yeah that should be exactly half hour okay remember that note this time 11 50 23 to 11 53 now we have 85 percent of the battery yeah also by the way ninjas i'm not just using the game i'm also using these uh, other apps which uh, are showing these informations over the screen remember that uh, if you want to check my uh, 4k uh, 4k video quality gameplay of the fortnite uh, with the OnePlus 8T, check it out on my YouTube channel. This is not a gameplay, Ninjas. This is just a gaming reference for battery drainage test. Remember that. What a beast, what a beast. We're going to be checking the temperatures after 15 minutes. And uh, yeah, the thermals. We're going to check the thermals. And plus uh, the performance of the uh, Fortnite at max epic mode 90 FPS frame rate. Oh my God. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I repeat again, uh, Fortnite at 30 FPS is a crappy, crappy game. I don't know how anybody enjoys in Fortnite playing it at 30 FPS. It's just terrible experience. Seriously, it's terrible, completely terrible, terrible experience. Check this frame. <laughs> oh my god. What a beast. <laughs> wow. Amazing. So I don't know. Like I said, I repeat again. That's why I want to do also battery drainage test. We will see will it take the same battery uh, percentage as other games, around 10%, which we saw PUBG for half hour takes 10%, Arc for half hour takes 10% also. Wow. <laughs> oh my God. I wish that YouTube has 90 FPS, but again, you would have to have a 90 FPS display to check the difference. Wow. Also, the touch sampling rate of the OnePlus 8 is just amazing. The quality of display, the all of the coding, the, the, just the quality uh, of the feeling of touching here. When you touch the display, you just feel this. Yeah, it's premium. It's just completely premium panel, bro. 
it's probably the best display for the six hundred dollars in just the best display okay so i already can feel that the phones is right now approaching the overheating stage if i can go like that let's check here the temperature 402 almost close to overheating as soon as it crosses uh, above 43 that is overheating issue ninjas again this is completely normal ninjas uh, for fortnite at 90 fps i think many many games uh, will again <laughs> i repeat again uh, i'm right now not uh, correct in my statement because <laughs> i don't know any other android smartphone that can run fortnite at 90 fps usually maximum it's 60 fps I don't know about Samsung that they added with the latest. I didn't. I didn't test Samsung S20 series uh, in a while with the Fortnite. Somebody can correct me. But Huawei, Xiaomi, Vivo, Realme, Oppo, none of these phones have 90 FPS support with the Fortnite. So we can't know the. We can't know how much they're gonna heat up since they don't have this option. Okay, remember that. So I don't know if this is normal, not normal. I can't tell it because I need to test more varieties of different brands, different phones. Okay, stay tuned. We see, we see, we're gonna see each other in 15 minutes. By the way, I just wanted to show you how heavy this game is. Just to download, it takes 10 GB of storage of download. That is crazy. We are still at 90 FPS epic mode, and you can see myself. It's not running 90 FPS. It's average 75 FPS or so, or maybe 80, something like that. Stay tuned. Okay, and just here we're gonna just testing a little bit, frame it. And let me just see here. Okay, I'm gonna wait until it drops down. So far here, beginning a second match, running around 90 FPS here, but we will wait for the ground uh, action. Okay, Ninja, so like you see myself here, the second round, uh, more heating here happening with the OnePlus 8T uh, with the 90 FPS mode at Epic mode. And uh, right now it's running under 70 FPS. Check this out. Under 70 FPS. Yes, we can say it requires more optimization this game. Uh, we, yes, we can say this is a new phone, maybe uh, the OnePlus 8T requires more optimization. Who knows, but uh, we could wait later on, somebody can maybe repeat this test in a few months. Uh, anyway, we should right now here, just a minute, go to settings. See, 90 FPS epic mode. Checking here the temperatures. So now we get to 43 degrees. Not any single Android smartphone is heating like Fortnite. I didn't test the Genshin, but uh, with all the games which I tested, do not heat this much. At all. Not even close. Uh, the OnePlus 8T, you can see by itself that this game is not using the full capabilities, the full power of the CPU. Check this out, Ninjas. Throughout and at the beginning of the game, you probably notice here the CPU clock speed, yeah? It doesn't use, it doesn't use. Okay, just more test here right now regarding the frame rate. Check it out now. Right now it's average 55 FPS out of 90 FPS. And in just if you are playing game at 90 FPS and suddenly the game drops from 90 FPS to 55, you're gonna see the difference. You're gonna see the difference there. Just to make a conclusion there, math there. For example, if uh, you are playing the game like constantly, at, if you are playing the 60 FPS mode, if you have, uh, it can go more than 60 FPS and it drops to 55, you're gonna not, you're not gonna notice that light that much as if you're gonna notice it right now from 90 to 55 FPS. It's logic. You probably hope uh, you agree with me and I hope you understand what I'm saying to you. Okay, now showing here around 50 FPS. Check it out here. I even get 47 FPS drop here with the Fortnite on OnePlus 8T. Man, this is <laughs> demanding, very demanding game right now. The latest update, 10 gigabyte of, uh, 10 gigabyte of download. Yes, ninjas, just to download this game takes 10 gigabyte. Can you believe that? Okay, now we are up to 65 FPS. But you can notice here that uh, the game is not using the full power of the CPU. And just this is me when uh, looking down. So I just want to say that. Uh, uh, it's not like you're gonna get, you're gonna run, this game is gonna run at 50 FPS constantly when it drops, when it lags. No, 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 this is uh, uh, this is ninjas at certain areas and at certain angle of viewing angle, like you see myself. Check this out. Certain viewing angles. If 
I look at the sky, it's running like 90 FPS constantly. If I look at the ground constantly, if I look a little bit like this, and it's running like you see myself here, variable F frame rate. I need to bring up this counter so close because most of you are using phones to watch my videos. So that's why. Okay, let's go next. So I'm gonna wait, I think five minutes more is gonna be half hour. Okay, and just interesting. <clears throat> so almost for 25 minutes of gaming, the temperature didn't go higher than 42.5. This is very impressive. This is very, very impressive. Uh, so honestly, technically, we can't even say that this is an overheating issue right now uh, with the physical temperatures, but on the battery, indeed it is. Let me just bring it here in close up. Check this out, 43 Celsius on the battery. Just a minute, 43 on CPU 59. Let me check here on the back for you. Back should be cooler, back should be cooler. Indeed, check it out here on the back, bro. Much, much cooler. Let's check here the camera bump. Camera bump is very thin, bro. Amazing. Com in comparison to Xiaomi Mi 10T and T10, T10 Pro, it's like two times thinner, bro. That's why I love the design of the OnePlus 8. It's amazing. It's compact. It's beautiful. It's light. It's thin. I love it. I just love it, bro. That's why I say better buy OnePlus 8T. I know, I know it doesn't have 144 hertz adaptive refresh screen, but still 120 fluid display AMOLED panel, it's beast, bro. So at this area, closer to the circle with many enemies, it's running under 50 FPS at this look, but if I go uh, like that, the FPS will improve ninjas, improving again, different angles looking in a different area of the map so far the lowest that we saw was 47 I think so but that's what like for nanosecond I would say that this game averagely it's running just around maybe 70 FPS yeah averagely 70 FPS when you're considering some areas when less enemies more enemies will drop less enemies will have more FPS average I would say it's around 70 FPS or so, something like that. Right now, right now it's average 60 FPS here in this close-up range. By the way, Ninjas, if you're gonna tell me I'm living somewhere in, in I don't know, in Saudi Arabia. No, I'm not living in Saudi Arabia. My temperature of my room, Ninjas, it's probably 20, 20 degrees. It's very cold. Just the, the table is very cold, the wall is very cold, so let's check this out i'm right now pointing at the wall it's 17 degrees my table it's what 18 it's very cold it's still seriously very cold here in my room right now i'm living in bosnia and it's winter here so don't tell me uh your phone one plus 80 should be in a cooler room or something like that come on give me a break bro. okay just that's it that is it that's it it's uh, right now it's a uh, 50 what do we get ninjas 53 temperature uh, 53 time 11:54. so we one minute more extra and 68 ninja 68 of the battery check this out let me just bring you 68 percent 68 percent after half hour of fortnite and it's 11:54. okay 11:54. you see here the temperatures cpu and battery temperature and here we can see the battery percentage 68 percent 68 percent ninjas took 68% we're gonna quickly go open AIDA64 go to thermals check here the thermals ninjas check this out battery 42.8 this is not bad at all this is a huge improvement from OnePlus 7 and OnePlus 8 series regarding the Fortnite at 90 FPS epic mode epic mode ninjas you saw that you saw that let me just open again Fortnite and show you again the settings here you go 90 fps epic morning just check this out that is insane that is insane great temperatures Ch trust me ninjas this is right now why i'm calling this overheating and, and i shouldn't even call it overheating because uh, all, all the smartphone games which i tested uh, uh, with oneplus 80 were running uh, maximum 38 degrees which is crazy that is not even heating bro that's super cool cool temperatures 
the best phone so far in, it's even better but the temperatures are better than the asus or g3 black shark 3 red magic it's crazy man since this is not an uh, an active gaming device as those devices uh, like a proper ca categorized uh, gaming device it doesn't have a, an actual fan inside of it crazy man check this out beautiful ninjas so let's check it out here so what do we saw we saw 68 percent with the battery 68 percent then just check it out so uh, at 11 53 68 percent so that's basically what what is that Seven, oh my god what is this for one uh, for half hour 17 percent ninjas 17 percent i'm gonna bring here just a one plus eight i'm gonna bring a one plus eight here quickly we're gonna go to the battery uh time because we we should see here fortnite okay we should here see v v full detail check this out okay okay i did have it uh, i have to be i have to be a fair play for you guys i was running before starting this video fortnite more than half hour you can see by itself there you go for one hour and 10 minutes it took 30 percent in just 30 percent but i have to admit that uh, this is not uh, kind of a correct uh, way to right now show you results for one hour and 10 minutes why because around 10 15 minutes the game was run was just in the menu okay remember that the game was just in the menu so this is a proper proper real real test so don't think right now you're gonna get uh, for one hour uh, it's gonna just drain for 30 percent no it's gonna drain more it should drain in just what it should drain, drain even almost like around 30 uh Five for 35 percentages around 35 to 37 percent per one hour which is crazy yes this is really crazy 17 percent for 30 minutes 17 percent for 30 minutes so uh we will say for one hour around 35 to 37 percent of the battery 35 to 37 percent for one hour that is crazy ninjas <laughs> that is completely crazy you can't even get with this time you can't even get three hours of fortnite with this setup on oneplus 80 how heavy this game is on 90 fps with epic mode and trust me ninja this device has an epic epic battery life seriously it has amazing amazing battery life the oneplus 80 super optimized the chip and the oxygen os is just super super optimized chip bro and the smartphone itself with uh, their own android skin it's fluid uh, spoiler alert this is the fastest smartphone in the in my life the fastest smartphone in my opinion right now in the market that you can buy for this price tag nothing can beat it crazy crazy fast faster than samsung s20 series faster than the huawei p20 uh, p40 series with the kirin 990 a uh, made a text chipset snapdragon previous snapdragon phones this one beats them all Thank you for watching this video this video i hope you enjoyed in this very in-depth thorough battery drain testage with the fortnite at 90 fps epic mode with the oneplus 8t by the way just remember that i uh, the in the background the the phone was running on 120 hertz high refresh rate okay remember that it was running at that high refresh rate it was not running at 60 hertz uh, because it makes no sense to put a 60 hertz because i was running the game at 90 fps i need to choose 120 hertz unfortunately the con of the oneplus and their android skin there is no 90 hertz uh, mode and there's no adaptive sync which basically will kind of uh, adaptively adaptively uh, change lower or higher uh, the re refresh rate of the screen so it can adapt to the fps to the frames per second of the app itself that it can afford it okay anyway thank you for watching ninjas don't uh, don't get me wrong regarding this test three hours fortnite this is just absolutely crazy because fortnite right now is one of the best apps to test for the battery drainage test at, but at 90 fps i repeat again at 90 fps it drains more battery than uh, other uh, most of the other android games i didn't test genshin maybe genshin will have similar results i don't know just you can find that on the youtube channel thank you for watching this video subscribe my youtube channel and shop online with my links remember everything was updated to the latest version with oneplus 8t peace